This is Jeff Crosby with the Central District Fishing Report. Lake temperatures across the region are running in the uh, upper 70s. Largemouth bass fishing at many of the area lakes are still very good, especially Taylorsville and Harrington Lakes. Creek arms are very productive areas. Pitching pig and jig combos and crankbaits along shoreline cover appears to be the most productive pattern at this time. And additionally, uh, at Taylorsville and Harrington, catches of crappie have been increasing. Standing timber or brush pile adjacent to deep water and six to ten feet of water have been very productive. Live minnows and crappie jigs have been the best baits for catching crappie. And don't forget about Beaver, Elmer Davis, McNeely, Corinth, or Bolts Lakes this time of year for good catches of bluegill and shellcracker. Be safe, grab your pole, and hope to see you on the water. This is Rob Rold in the Northwestern Fishery District with some angling highlights in our area. Rough River Lake and Nolan River Lake are both at Summer Pool and holding steady. Anglers are still picking up a few crappie by fishing some of the deeper brush piles, catching them on both jigs and minnows. Catfish are also still active at both reservoirs. Bass fishing activity at both reservoirs has been fairly slow of late. At Lake Malone, anglers have been catching several crappie of late, fishing some of the deeper brush piles there, somewhere around the 8 to 10 or 12 foot depth range and they're catching them on both jigs or minnows. A few bass are also still being caught at Lake Malone, mainly by fishing some of the topwater or soft plastic baits around and along the shoreline vegetation, especially at night. As always, be careful on the water. Good luck. Remember to wear your life jackets. In West Kentucky at Kentucky Market Lakes, fall fishing patterns are starting to pick up with bass out on the ledges using some crankbaits and plastic worms and lizards. You might also try up around your boat docks. Again, worms and lizards and spinner baits. The shad are still somewhat in the back end of the embayment, so evening fishing around woody habitat in the shallow waters with topwater bait can always be fun. Not a lot of big fish, but maybe a lot of smaller fish just for the fun of it. Some of the fishermen are catching a few crappie out off the ledges, spider rigging mostly with vertical fishing jigs. Fishing in the tailwaters below Kentucky and Barkley Dams has been pretty good for stripers, white bass, catfish, and the enjoyment of catching a big silver carp. Most of the time they just foul hook, but worth trying. So this is Paul Reister and hope you find a good day to go fishing.